Hello everybody and welcome to our new video. So in today's video, I will be showing you how to import bookmarks, password and data into Firefox. So it is very easy if you follow my tutorial from the beginning to the end. So I have already shown you how you can actually install and set up your Firefox in a video here that I have already uploaded. You can just go and watch that video for your later experience if you're facing any problem in downloading or setting up your Firefox account so let's not just make this video any longer just let's jump into the main topic so how you can actually import bookmarks password and data into the Firefox for that you have to go for settings uh, let me just see if I can build it in any other way I don't think so, I just have to go for settings. Here in settings, you will find the option of sync. Uh, here it is. So, as you can see, the syncing is on. So, it will already uh, sync your bookmarks, history, password, and everything in the supervise. So, how to sync it now? Just sync now. You can even connect to other device. If you are already using Firefox in your mobile, you can do this. So if you just sync your Firefox with other device, you can actually sync everything that you are using your firefox will be here in your desktop so if you don't using the firefox how to sync this just go to continue uh, by scanning this qr code in your mobile your firefox will be ready and it will firefox will be installed and it will be synced in your mobile phone so these are you can actually sync your bookmarks history open tabs password addresses payment methods add-ons and settings from another device to this device <coughs> after you have synced uh, you will see everything here bookmarks history downloads password everything will be shipped to you and you can easily just uh, don't need to give password every time you are using it uh, this will make your life this, uh, <laughs> not the life actually this will make your browsing experience more easier more convenient so I uh, if you are using uh, Mozilla Firefox I hope you will find this video very helpful and useful so that is all for today let's see you in another video thank you for watching